Screen printing. Instead of spending up to $30 on your favorite band's shirts, or that super special ALF t-shirt, now you can make it yourself. The supplies that you need are an embroidery hoop, some nylon or silk fabric, a container of Mod Podge matte glue, paint or ink, variously sized brushes, a can of clear coat acrylic sealer, a pair of scissors, and a pencil. First, take your embroidery hoop and separate the two circles. Place the fabric over the large circle and replace the small circle. Screw the loop together as tightly as possible, making sure the fabric is taut across the hoop. Cut off the excess fabric. Using your paintbrush, apply a coat of Mod Podge where the fabric touches the hoop. Apply to both sides of the frame. This will make your screen much sturdier. Allow an hour for drying. Take the design you want on a shirt, such as a badass picture of Magneto, and lay it on a flat surface. Place the screen on top of the design, fabric side down. Trace the design onto the fabric using your pencil. Try to do it this fast. Come on. I dare ya. After you are done tracing, you should have an exactly replicated design. I like to retrace the design in Sharpie, even though it is not necessary. Next, paint Mod Podge onto the spaces where you don't want the ink to go through. Paint all around your design, being careful not to go over the lines. Use smaller brushes to apply the glue to finer areas. Your finished product should look something like this. Let it dry for 24 hours before using it. Now let's go over that one more time. Place your design on a flat surface, then place your screen on top of the design. Use a pencil to trace the design onto your screen. Now she paints the Mod Podge all around the design, not painting where she wants ink to flow through. Huh, looking pretty good. Now we find something to screen, like this t-shirt. If you're going to screen onto a t-shirt, it's probably a good idea to get a piece of cardboard and place it in between the two sides of the shirt, so the ink does not leak through. Place the screen fabric side down where you want the design to be. Take your ink or paint and drip a line onto your screen. Use a folded up piece of paper or cardboard to squeegee the paint over your screen. Be sure to hit every unmodged podged section with paint. Be careful while doing this. The more ink that is pushed through with each pass will create bolder patterns and possible bleeding. Also, be sure not to shift the screen while squeegeeing. Remove the screen by lifting the hoop straight up. Using your acrylic sealer, spray a coat onto your screened item in a well-ventilated room. Allow the item 24 to 72 hours to dry before putting it in the wash. The materials for this process cost just under $12 and the screen can be used up to 35 times. After you are done with your screen for the day, or if it gets clogged with paint, wash it using only cold water. Check back soon for more tutorials showing more complicated uses of this process, such as multicolored printing and combination of designs.